Thanks, Paige. Parents, listen up. A free event in Green Bay will help your kids stay active. Emily oh, Dean, oh, joins us live from Lambeau Field Atrium to explain. Hi, Em. Hey, Angie and Doug. Hi, everybody. Yeah, Project Leap starts this morning at 10 a.m. It's out here at the Lambeau Field Atrium, a free event for the family. It's a way to get kids moving. And check out these kids over here that are rock wall climbing. Really cool, this stuff that they have out here. I have a couple new friends. I got Megan and Andy over here. Megan, you were telling me she's never rock climbed before. So how excited are you to get up there? I got to climb the wall. That's my first time, so I'm excited. How was it? Good. Good? And I know, Andy, I saw you cheering on some of your friends over there. Tell me about that. You're cheering them on? I was trying to cheer them on so they could reach the top. How about that? That's a nice friend right there. Okay, girls, you go ahead. You climb the wall again. Have fun this morning. Bring your kids out here. You know, we got rock wall. We got a bunch of other things, too. Check this out. Face painting. Another thing that you can have out here. Carly's getting a nice heart. We have Jody Wires who is here. She's from the American Red Cross. Uh, volunteers are coming out and doing face painting and a lot of other stuff. Jesse Mickey is over here with me. Jesse, tell us about the event today and the main goal. Um, the event runs today, like you said, from 10 to 4. It's just one of the free community events we host each year. Um, and again, it just is a way to give back to our community. Um, we have some great stuff going on, inflatables, the climbing walls, the bungee trampoline, some face painting. Um, and we have a great giveaway. We actually have our Play 60 wristband. Um, and, of course, we're trying to go ahead and make sure kids remember every day to play their 60 minutes. Uh, another thing, too, see, Carly has here her socks on. That's what you want kids, what do you Absolutely. want them to wear when they come out? If they can wear their socks and then athletic shoes. For the climbing wall, it would be helpful for them to have shoes. And um, flip-flops or sandals or any other kind of shoe would be a little more challenging than just a, a plain tennis shoe. And then socks for um, the inflatables. Jody, you're being very artistic this morning. How's it going? Oh, it's going very well. I have a good little artist here. <laughs> little little girl here who's sitting very still so her heart doesn't look deformed here. <laughs> Carly, it looks great. And that's what it's about today. Just having fun. Rock wall climbing. We got a bungee trampolines. A lot of stuff going on this morning. And it sounds like somebody just hit the button up there. They made it up the wall. So you can come out here today. We have all the information, too, on Online. We'll send it back to you. Did you make it up the rest of the wall? No, I didn't. <laughs> That's and okay, because you got further than I would have. Yeah, you've been wrong. It is really difficult, and I see those kids just flying up there, and I'm like, maybe they're just not thinking too hard. Maybe I'm just like, I, I can't do this, I can't do this, and maybe they're just thinking positive, so I'm going to have to ask them what their secret is. There you go. We'll find out. Thanks, Adam. <laughs> see ya.